This is the ABC7 Morning News. A Silicon Valley startup wants you to let somebody else do your shopping. The idea is taking off so fast the company has secured a second round of funding and expects to be profitable in just two years. In fact, as ABC7's Amy Hollyfield reports, the company's founder predicts shopping as we know it may one day be a thing of the past. It all started when Scott Dunlap's wife was dragging him around the mall as she looked for a pair of boots. And I was realizing, gosh, it would be so much easier if I could pull out my mobile phone and find every store that sells that pair of boots, uh, then I could direct her. And so, Nearby Now was born, a website you can ask to find those boots for you. The site has contracts with 200 malls across the country. It will search the one closest to you and look for the item. You'll get to see pictures of what it finds and choose the one you like the best. Then someone from a call center in the Midwest will call the store for you and have the clerk put it on hold under your name. And you can do that either before you go to the mall by using your computer at home or using your mobile phone while you're at the malls. Some malls will eventually have kiosks you can use to search the website. It's free for you. The company makes its money when an item is on hold. The store then pays nearby now. Busy shoppers say this sounds like exactly what they need. Most of the stuff that I do is online, but it's looking at several different websites and several different screens just to find what you want and then when you find it then you look and it's like oh it doesn't have your size or it doesn't have the color that you want so um, yeah to have that that would save lots of time even just spending time online we decided to try the service ourselves we searched for black walking shoes picked out the pair we liked and waited at the Westfield Shopping Center in San Francisco 15 minutes later a text message came in on the cell phone saying the shoes weren't available but it gave a website where we could order them from when we went to the walking store, Brad confirmed he didn't have the shoes, but he did have the flip-flops the PR representative had requested for us as part of the test. So nearby now worked. But some shoppers say despite the convenience, they think shopping will always be a time-consuming event. Yeah, you're going to walk around for a while before you go to the store. Because like, I already know it's there. Let me see what else the mall has. But Dunlap thinks shopping, even the relatively new concept of online shopping, is forever going to change. Getting something shipped to you in 24 hours is no longer fast enough. That's right. Really, I think our biggest value proposition is if you want it right now, if you want to go pick it up in the next 20 or 30 minutes. Just further evidence that Generation Y will live up to its reputation as a generation that wants instant gratification. Amy Hollyfield, ABC7 News. All right, let's take a look at this morning's must-reads. Here's